breaks on Kapama Private Game Reserve. The morning is alive with activity. But the day is already humid and heavy with danger. Lions are the instigators in the bush, the dictators of Kapama. And the king and the queen of this jungle have a definite taste for warthog. This is dominance. They are the monarchs of the food chain. But they are not the only rulers in Kapama. To the north roams a pale pride of hungry lions, the Maria pride. These are super efficient hunters, a family of 13 cleaners. They sweep the plains daily for their plunder, and they do well. This is no place for Cheetah. This is no place for the weak. A few weeks ago, this female Cheetah gave birth to five cubs. Hyena killed two, and a Betelur eagle killed the third. The mother still patrols the area in search of her other cubs, uttering the contact call that would normally summon them to her. Instinct causes her to persist in her search, but reality brings her back to what she has left. Raising her remaining cubs has been hard. She is not skilled at parenting. How can she be, coming from a rehabilitation center? She was treated at the Hootsprate Endangered Species Center and reintroduced into the wild two years ago. So she knows how to survive, but she doesn't yet know enough about raising cubs. It is not enough to hunt and hide from other predators. Now she has to think like a cheetah cub. Speed is no longer an option for escape. She has made many mistakes along the way. Could she be making the worst of them tonight? Taking her cubs onto the plains instead of back to the thickets? Every shadow holds a threat. The stage is set. and the drama promises to unfold under a spotlight. The king and the queen are in the area. There is no intolerance like that between competing predators. The hierarchy must be observed. From every vantage point she can find, the female calls for her absent offspring. 
her single remaining cub mimicking her summons. But their calls remain unanswered. The reason, an obvious inevitability. Nevertheless, she persists in her search, patrolling the plains for hours. Her cub soon tires and falls behind. There is danger on the horizon. The cheetah mother has not noticed them. It is the Maria pride the marauders of the bushveld. The lions advance tactfully. A cheetah is half the weight of a lion, and there are 13 lions. Strategically, they encircle the cheetahs and progressively close in. Today, the cheetah seems to have disappeared altogether, but emerges onto the plains the following day, where she lies listlessly. As the hours pass, her calls become softer and less frequent. The lions have destroyed this cheetah's entire family. What remains of it lies 10 meters from her. For two days, she remains with the little carcass. She doesn't call out for her cubs anymore. She just lies in the shade nearby, almost motionless. Then on the third day, as if an instinctual switch has been flicked. She simply gets up and walks away. Tragedy is the currency of the wild, but it also brings the lessons that will hopefully allow her to raise her next litter more successfully. <laughs> <laughs>